Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we will be setting up for the month of January, January 2020. Can you guys believe that? It's already another decade. I'm so excited of what's to come in the new year and kickstarting it with a sunflower theme. Oh, by the way, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, or just Happy Holidays. I hope your Christmas was just as amazing. I'm pretty sure mine would have been since i'll be with my family we'll be in a different city so i'm pretty sure it would be awesome i don't know if i already did but i am cooking up some amazing vlog footage for you guys so ex get excited for that by subscribing to my channel and hitting that bell button to be notified whenever i post a new video so i guess with that said let's get on to this video i'm starting you guys off at my procreate app and here i'm recreating the draft drawings that I did on my Good Notes app onto my Procreate app. So my setup for this month is first I'll be redrawing everything here and then in the later part of this video I'll be showing you guys how I'll be setting it up on my 2020 journal. Okay, now that all of that is clear, here I'm starting with my cover page. My cover page for January would be would obviously consist of sunflowers. Now, no worries, I know I've been posting two consistent back-to-back -back videos with a flower theme, but that won't be the case for my 2020 journal. It's just that I want to use the sunflower theme as my theme for this month because for me, sunflowers makes people happy. The color symbolizes a whole new day or for us, a whole new year. I guess what I'm saying is that I want our new year to start with a with happy thoughts of how amazing 2019 was and how amazing 2020 would be. How I drew a sunflower is by the very kindergarten way I know. It's a yellow flower with layered petals and I just added a shadow effect with a dry ink pen which is available in the app. Or I guess for anyone following with a paper journal, you can also use your colored pencils or watercolors and just make sure you use a one shade darker than the previous shade of yellow that you used earlier. the same page i also added a quote that reads advice from a sunflower be bright sunny and positive spread seeds of happiness rise shine and hold your head high a very positive note for the start of the new year don't you think So I lost quite a few footage of me creating some spreads so there might be a pop-up of screen recordings of me recreating some spreads. I kept my monthly spread very simple. I simply drew in a 7x7 boxes 
kept everything black and with the use of the sunflower that I drew in earlier, I pasted it onto my next page and just spread it out randomly. Make sure you won't be adding way too much onto your pages so it won't look as heavy or don't draw it way too big, just as simple, simple the better. And now for the next spread, I'm gonna be creating my habit tracker. I'll be making my habit tracker into a vertical layout just to change things a bit. I also added a code page at the left side and it reads, She's a sunflower, strong, bold, and true to herself. She may not be as lovely as a rose, but she's not also as fragile. Now, I don't know if you guys are still wondering by now where my mood tracker would be. Well, it would be on my traveler's journal, so do stay tuned for that. Um, again, if you haven't already, please click on the subscribe button as well as the bell button beside it to be notified whenever I'll be posting that one. Now for the next following pages, I'll be creating a bunch of weekly spreads ideas for you guys to easily recreate. And by the way, stay tuned until the end because I'll be mentioning something amazing for some of you guys. First, I created a single page layout for January 1st since it's another celebration with the family so I want this spread to be as open as possible so that we can either add in a few photos or mementos for us to look back on.
for the next spread idea is a horizontal layout again leaving out quite some spaces to write on some early goals that we want to achieve basically the first week of the new year we or maybe just me to plan out everything with how i want my month to go on Basically for the next spreads, it's pretty much the same, so I'll be speeding up everything a bit. But no worries, you'll still be able to see the process of how I created the layout in the next part of this video. I just sped up everything since the drawings are pretty much the same. I just it it just had has a different layout to it.
So by now, basically, I'm I'm just adding all my drawings onto my Good Notes app, and I'm pretty much done. I'm just adding a few bits and twigs of highlights of drawings and whatnot to my draw or to my Good Notes app. And by the way, the something that I mentioned earlier, the something amazing that I well, I hope it just as amazing as I'm thinking it would be but yeah all photos or all drawings that I did will be available on my Pinterest app I'll be posting everything on December 30th so do follow me over there to be notified whenever I post this one I'll be uploading it as a PNG so that you guys can download it as a sticker or however you want to use it I hope this is as helpful or this is a helpful way for you guys to recreate these drawings or the spreads and yeah I hope you guys are excited as I am to share this um this drawings to you guys I don't know anyways thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you do and again please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and stay tuned for more amazing videos to come in the new year Again, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to everyone. I love you guys so much and thank you for supporting my channel up to this day. Bye guys!